Hey everyone, this is Daryl Christopher coming at you from Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. It is Wednesday, so that means it's New Comic Book Day. It's April 8, 2015. This is what I picked up today. We have Star Wars Darth Vader number 4. We have The Walking Dead 140. I remember picking this up a long time ago, the first issue, but now we have uh, Battlestar Galactica 6 number 2 finally come out. And it's been so long, I don't even remember what happened in the first issue, but it's going to be a good read, I can tell you that right now. We have Escape from New York, number 5. We have The Black Vortex, chapter 11, uh, featured in Captain Marvel, number 14. We have uh, Ant-Man, number 4. Uh, and as you can see, he's got the uh, 1980s style Miami Vice uh, kind of cover there, very interesting. We have Roman Ritual, number three. It's been an awesome read so far. I'm looking forward to seeing where the story's going. We have Hulk, number 14. This should be good. We have the uh, Star Trek Planet of the Apes crossover, the Primate Directive, issue number five. We have the sub cover here. As you can see, uh, one of the uh, gorillas is, uh, is holding a, bat a Klingon Batleth. Very cool. This I haven't checked out before, but the guy at the comic book shop, uh, the comic book shop on Clyde in uh, Nepean, was very impressed that I picked this up. We have Knights of the Dinner Table. I'm always open-minded to try out different comics, so I'm looking forward to seeing what this is about. Here's an issue that I picked up uh, just strictly for the cover. I thought it was kind of neat. We have Satellite Sam, issue number 12. And as you know, all these issues will be reviewed for episode 7 of Comic Book Hall Review right here on the Reverie Soul YouTube channel. I was meaning to check this out from the beginning, but I finally got into it. We have Big Trouble in Little China, number 9. And uh, yeah, I guess I'm showing off my sweeter side here. We uh, I couldn't resist this. We have um, My Little Pony. Number two, Friendship is Magic. Should be a good read. Here's an issue I picked up just for uh, seeing what it's about. We have uh, Witcher number one of five from Dark Horse. I don't know what it's about, but I'll let you know. And uh, I'll, of course, let you know what I think of it. These days, though, I'm very rarely disappointed by a comic because with the print runs being so small, uh, you know, comics have to be good in order to sell, like, even... 100,000 copies, so we're in the Twilight Age here, so I think it should be okay. But of course, I'll let you know in the Episode 7 review. One of my favorite horror movies from uh, back in the day is finally getting a comic book treatment. We have uh, Reanimator number 1 from Dynamite. And I also picked up a couple uh, trade paperback and hardcover uh, compilations. For, uh, for the Episode 7 review, we have the uh, Squadron Supreme from Marvel. And we have the original graphic novel. We have the Avengers Rage of Ultron. So that should be pretty good. As you can see, it's a pretty dreary day. So I'm just going to spend the next week reading these and getting together my notes for the ep Episode 7 review. Thank you very much for your time, everyone. Have a good day and enjoy New Comic Book Day. As you know, I always make the videos for the people who love comic books, uh, the people that are bored at work and are willing to watch anything, and the people that just like random YouTube videos. Thank you all for viewing. Please subscribe if you like, but uh, stay tuned for more. We've got some great episodes coming up here, right here on the Reverie Soul channel. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.